All right, folks, welcome back. Today we are going bargain hunting for golf clubs once again. This is day number six of seven golf stores in seven days. And this is probably one of the most interesting golf stores in all of America. It is, in fact, America's golf clearance outlet, and it has an insane location, as I'm sure you guys can hear. We've got helicopters coming in. We've got a Del Taco, the only thing that can compete with that with uh, Taco Bell. We've got Fun Spot over there. We're less than a mile away from Universal uh, Studios. Is it a fun spot? It's a fun spot. We got 10 minutes away from Disney. <laughs> it's a crazy spot, but uh, this place is one of the coolest golf stores that we've ever been yes. to. It's like a time capsule. <laughs> they don't really specialize in used golf clubs, which is what we specialize mm -hmm. in, but we found some uh, good deals in here in the uh, past, but never know what you're gonna find though, so. Let's go find it. Check this out though. They've got the old Ben Hogan yes. logo. We've got a uh, Callaway TaylorMade Titleist Ping Footjoy. And look at this, it's like an old uh, Vegas uh, sign over here, the uh, golf outlet. Pretty amazing. Pretty amazing. You guys are gonna see clubs that you haven't seen, brand new in plastic, in probably over a decade. This place is, we're running out of adjectives already, and it's uh, one minute into the video. It's also, pretty amazing. hopefully you can hear any of that. Oh, that made for the best intro ever, right. but uh, let's go inside and see what we can find. All right, starting things off with a banger right here. Check out this Hanma Tour Model staff bag with the umbrella. That is cool, but, wait. but I think this, <laughs> $105, this might be coming home with us. The price <laughs> is wrong. Happy Gilmore, Bob Barker versus Happy. The that, collab you didn't know you needed. Oh, I, I definitely knew that I needed that. I just didn't know that it existed. Yes. They've also got tons of cool like apparel and stuff. We've got a Yes gift set right here. It's We've got awesome. Hanma head covers. They usually have a bunch of uh, Hanma uh, golf clubs in here as well and there's like mm -hmm. a massive collection of scotty cameron head covers Even back here daphne like safari oh, themed yeah. i didn't know that daphne made no i didn't either putter head covers oh got the giraffe we're good to go on the uh the safari at uh like Animal what i Kingdom. said best ride at disney world because it changes every single time <laughs> right. got ten dollars off these uh tour edge hats we've got an autographed toronto maple leafs from a uh, old goalie there that's pretty awesome look at the uh the hockey pads on this it's like some fine leather right there that seems very uncomfortable. Yeah, that's uh, got to be pretty uh, hefty. Right. But, uh, let's go check out the uh, hefty. It's also got tons and tons. I think this is like uh, basically they'll get like overruns and courses uh, don't have them. But mm -hmm. this is like a Peter Millar and it's like 60% off the uh, usual yeah, price. Yeah, so if so. you don't care about the course, you're getting really good quality for Worcester Country Club. huge. Yeah, if you guys are from Worcester Country Club, come down here. You'll there probably you get go. it for uh, way cheaper. <laughs> got a ton. What is this one? Ooh, that's just cool in Perpuduk. general. Uh, Comment below if you guys have ever played Perpuduk. <laughs> Please let me know. That is kind of amazing <laughs> right there, but uh, let's check out the uh, U section. Let's see what we got going on. We got one of the uh, newer Cleveland's, couple of the uh, Wilson putters, which are super underrated mm -hmm. Wilson staff. I forget which one this is. The West Loop, they're all named after parts of uh, Chicago where Wilson Golf is headquartered. Got another one down here. Oh, this is the answer style one. I kind of like the answer styles that have three alignment aids because these two will frame the ball and then that one you can use a line on, which is uh, interesting. What's this one called? Windy City. There you go. There you go. I remember they're all, uh, it's I have Chicago the, thing. Yeah, the I bean. have the bean one, which is mm -hmm. uh, really cool. It's kind of shaped like this. Kind of like, like a, a bean. number five uh, <laughs> offset. 330 mallet. Interesting right there. We also got a uh, three ball right there. Interesting. <laughs> I've said nice. right there and interesting a thousand times already. Speaking of interesting, that head covers. Oh, the Royal Guards. Fascinating. What? I don't know what's happening I, there. I would Comment attack. Below. Yeah, I would attack the queen if this is what the uh, Royal Guard looked like. <laughs> it's so cute. Or and the fluffy. king. I should say the king. The sorry. Yes. And a bunch of uh, head cover sets. Got some Ping G400s. World Golf Championships. Nice. Got some Skull and Bones ones up there. Some tailor-made Sims. Oh, I forgot this is the place, speaking of championship. Oh, yeah, this is where the uh, World Long Drive uh, record was set with a Tour Edge 3-wood yeah, by Maurice Allen. Here, right? Yeah, this is the exact club that broke the, I think it was the ball speed record. Yeah, sorry. Yeah, sorry. yeah. the official record was 211. And uh, he broke it here with the Tour Edge Exotics 3-wood. Isn't that's that crazy? The, that's the ball speed record for all clubs, like yeah. including drivers. And he broke it with a 3-wood. That's pretty amazing. Also, is that the golf ball? It was a Slazenger golf ball? <laughs> What's more impressive, setting the ball speed record with a Slazenger golf ball or with a three wood? I think it's a The combo. tour edge three woods are absolutely amazing. They got a bunch of uh, tour mm -hmm. edge stuff in here. We might get a little tour of the uh, Scotty Cameron stuff here in the uh, back the in a minute. The Mickey Scotty head covers. Oh yeah, we have the white one. Uh -huh. I'm not gonna tell you how much we spent on that, but. It was a pretty petty. I don't know, oh, so the, therefore keep it that way. The gruesome foursome up there, the Halloween oh, one. Yeah. Got the Bazooka Joe one over there. Got the Abetinardi Queen B 
tons of cool stuff. Oh, look Bobby at the American. Yeah, look at the. Where's the Bobby Grace one? Oh, the there's a grip. Oh, the there. Bobby Grace grip. Yeah. Oh, I think that's one of the prototype ones. That's awesome. Oh, it has a price on it. Some of these aren't for sale. The Bobby Grace one has Ooh. a price on it. We'll have to check that out. Didn't we Let's find Let's look at a... the little Scotty over there with the USA flags. I've never seen that one. No. Didn't we find a prototype at a garage sale? But it was like a yeah. Guy and he, it was like his last name yeah. <laughs> he didn't even know what it was it was the guy bought it it was a, a one of one bobby grace prototype and the guy bought it because his last name was grace that video like, hasn't come out yet it was amazing oh sorry sneak preview sneak preview <laughs> also they got this right here just to make sure that you're uh, yes. not buying counterfeits these aren't for sale but it's uh, kind of interesting look so at how bad actually... the titleist font is and then like the actual thing is flaking away and then here do the shaft uh... oh yeah these are uh, project x 5.0s look at how thin they are compared to like an actual shaft it's like half yeah. the size. It's a. Uh, this is actually the VG3 are the uh, Japanese uh, issue. They're Japanese issue Titleists, mm -hmm. and these ones are uh, the Chinese version of them. But Even the clever. Golf Five Multi Compact. Look at how bad the. Uh, yeah, that's why. Like, look at the Titleist how it looks too. It looks terrible, it's, but they keep them out here, so just like you're. Be careful on what you're buying. Buyers mm -hmm. beware. Speaking of buyers beware, these things are absolutely beautiful. Col or the. Uh, custom ferrules right there on some 690 MVs. Mm -hmm, I like the ferrules. Those are absolute stunners right there. Oh, check this out. We got a uh, beryllium nickel. Oh, nice. These things are... I don't know. Might have to inquire on that. I was looking for the uh, price on that. <laughs> you have I'll a knack for doing that. That's my uh, specialty. <laughs> right. Rambling and saying the same phrases over and over again and picking things with uh, no prices. Yep. Got a bunch of uh, nicer wedges in here. And Check this one out. It's like a mint condition Cleveland 900. No VJ used those for a while. Got Tom Watson wedge over there. Got a couple a of the uh, milled grinds. RBZ A flick. Oh, yeah. Let's go. Uh huh. Oh, got the, a uh, TNT, even better. There you go. Northwestern <laughs> TNT. Got a full bag of these uh, Wilson staff models. Interesting. I wonder if this was like a tour player who brought these all in, or they got a uh, deal with uh, they Wilson. Were only fifty bucks. Yeah, that's pretty crazy. I really like the PMP wedges from uh, Wilson. These ones right here, they have mm -hmm. a nice uh, sole grind on them. Oh, well, this might actually be tour issue. It's got a uh, stamp right there. That looks like it's off a van. I don't know how to tell the uh, tour issue Wilson no. stuff. We'll have to uh, ask on that. But to check that old school Wilson out with the fluid feel through there. Dyna power. Dyna power for sure. Well, we got a tour stage. The Japanese. Uh, facing a uh, brand of Bridgestone. That's a cool that shaft. Super cool. And then when they came out in the uh, US, they switched to a uh, Bridgestone as it. But mm. when I was growing up, I, I don't know why, I always watched that uh, Japanese, um, like their Jap uh, Japanese golf tour. I forget what it was called. It was in oh. Japanese, so I had no idea what was uh, going on, but they all had tourist. Uh, you tour were envious of their clubs? Yeah, tour stage stuff, and I was envious of their clubs. Got a bunch of lefty stuff over here as well. 975D with an Aldi La MVS shaft, Ooh. kind of a decade apart. Ooh, Pink Faith. Nice. How much is that one going 55. for? 55. 55 bucks. Early Christmas present? <laughs> we'll consider that one. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Got some uh, Adams tight lights over here. They usually have a bunch of brand new Adam stuff, mm -hmm. so we're gonna go uh, check that out. We got the uh, Wilson Fat Shaft still with the sticker yes. on there. If you guys are, have never That's seen the amazing. Fat Shaft, it's absolute, literally a Fat Shaft. It's literally a Fat Shaft. There There's you go. technology and stuff that just like didn't catch on. It but... makes sense though. It resists twisting a little yeah. bit more, and if you can make it light, like these were made by Graphilite Pro Light, I think. So they're yeah, Graphilite Pro Light. So it's it's like a regular weighted shaft, but it's uh, extra thick. Now you know. Ooh, now speaking you know. of more head covers. Oh wow. These are cool. I've never Whoa. seen these before. Whoa. Like a takeout box. That's so cool. It's like 50 it's bucks. Special, special edition. edition takeout box. <laughs> Do you know the hack behind uh, takeout boxes too? No. That if you could like partially open it up, it becomes like a bowl. Oh yeah, I have yeah. seen that. Yeah. That's like one of the four TikTok videos I've ever seen. <laughs> But, you gotta, but I've never seen that, though. That's pretty awesome. <laughs> got a bunch of full sets over here. They kind of make full sets. There's a whole section of them over here because a lot of people come here on vacation, and mm -hmm. so they'll just build out uh, full sets. I don't know if they're like rentals or stuff. Whoa, a Bloody Mary Daphne <laughs> cover with a peacock. These are ones I haven't really seen before. Yeah, you got the pineapple, sunflower, Ooh, got tater tot. is pretty awesome. Yeah, it looks like the uh, dragon from uh, Mulan. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're getting distracted by the dumb Doesn't things. Doesn't take but much. There you go. You got some uh, brand new in plastic stuff. Let's see if there's any uh, old cool ones. I think these are the uh, Tourage chocolates. Yeah, Tourage yeah. chocolates. We found a full set of those at a uh, thrift store once. Yeah, we gave it to your mom. Mm hmm. Got a, these ones aren't as uh, crazy. There's like paradigms and stuff, but you'll see some old ones that are just like, here you go, to Cleveland Clean Bloom. Bloom. This is the ladies' section, apparently. You think we would uh, know because we come in here a lot. We don't really film that Authorized much in here because. Personnel only and groundhogs. Oh, wow. 
Fascinating. Sorry. <laughs> Easily <Yeah>. distracted. <laughs> Easily distracted <laughs> is uh, the name of the channel. Yeah, brand new. Look at these. Look at how shiny the Adams Those highlights are. Insanely are. shiny. That is cool. We got brand new in plastic Adams Super S. I, where else in the world are you going to find this dead stock? Here. That is. <laughs> I don't know awesome. why I get so excited. When I, it's, <laughs> even the though grip is still in plastic. That's awesome. The Calloway Steelhead X. Oh, look at this. I, uh, McGregor Mac Tech. Brand new in the plastic. I've kind of gotten into a, a collecting brand new in the plastic, just random old clubs. Yes. I don't know why, but it's just like so cool that it's just sat there it's forever. It's like preserved. Yeah. We have a little collection of uh, Adam's ones, but got a bunch of uh, overrun head, head covers, covers in here as well. Let's see if we can pick out a cool one. Tour Edge Exotics. Well, we found the one part where there's nothing interesting. Oh, we got some skull ones over here. Oh, these are cool. Oh, look at brand new arrow burners. These things those used to get very peel good all the time. I normally am not team iron covers, but those are pretty, yeah. pretty schnazzy. Very schnazzy. Let's see what we got over here in terms of the irons. Got some GTDs. I have never... Are these Japanese models? Oh, and there's a guy in here that specializes in uh, oh, paint fills. He does You'll see such some a good job. Absolutely, especially in like the putters. Paint. Yeah. Well, look at these. It's like Masters Edition uh, <laughs> oh, Taylor Made awesome. MBs. I think these are the 2012 uh, Taylor Made MB Tour Preferreds. Could Got be. Got some uh, ladies' ones behind us. Nice. Cleveland Bloom. That's kind of they give you the uh, breakdown oh, of yeah. it. Oh, yeah. That's clever. Bunch of uh, newer pings. Let's try and find a cool. Uh, here we go. We got a, a cool uh, colorway on this. The uh, JPX 921. It's got the Masters <laughs> colors on the Rogue STs. Whoa, what are those grips? Whoa. Those are cool. Kidero. Never seen those before. It's actually really clever, too, to do. Like, they've done it a couple times where it's like yeah. alternating. Alternating. Yeah, the Masters ones over here yeah. on the uh, 2012. Those are cool. Clever. Never seen that before. Interesting, interesting. Let's see what else we got in terms of the colorways. Oh, we got a Tiffany colorway over here. Um, <laughs> these are the T200s. Awesome. Those look with so the cool. They have the matching grips to go along with it. We got some Hanmas up here. I oh, know these are, what are these? They look like Hanmas. The, oh wait. Wazaki. Oh those yeah. those the ones that make the gold? Yeah, yeah they yeah. made the whole gold um, hybrid like, set. Mm -hmm. Someone sent us those in one of our unboxing videos. Those were super fun to a hit. It was an entire set of, uh, hybrids gold though. yeah they they're felt gold fancy. plated very very fancy speaking of fancy we got to get another uh, fancy colorway in here where are they gonna oh over here check these out another uh, tiffany on uh, yes. the uh, x ford cb the xander shoffley specials and look at these got the uh, wilson dynapowers tiffany out the, oh, sorry dual tone on this one too yeah it looks cool got the uh, red white and blue right nice. there with the red white and blue uh, golf pride grips this place is so interesting. I don't know <laughs> why. Just I just walk get... around for oh, here, These are ones that he's uh, done custom. Oh, yeah. The uh, colorways on White Hot uh, Rossi OG, the uh, John Rom special, although he uses the other offset on there. Got an M Craft. Check this what thing is out. The fill? That's cool. Absolutely blinged out. <laughs> got some uh, custom colorways over here. Got some uh, Vokies. Got the Tiffany Cleveland. Look at the Ray Cook customization. <laughs> <laughs> that one's uh, interesting. All right, let's see. So if, if you ever need any custom, that's what we're getting. Yeah, that's very let's, good. Let's see if we can find any uh, old uh, dead stock weirdos over here. That's what we like. We've got the uh, Callaway XR. It's not the super S strange. Of, uh... Bazooka Force. Yeah, it's definitely the uh, us of, uh, <laughs> dead stock of weirdos. stuff. Oh, I got a McGregor. It's not in plastic though. Got old uh, tight lies. Oh, here we go. A tight lies still in plastic. Nice. I don't know. Comment below if you also find this fascinating. <laughs> Hopefully. Hopefully. Well, this is going to be the worst video of really all weird. time. <laughs> it's not very good commentary. And uh, if you don't find that interesting, then you've already clicked off. Oh, brand new Adams XTD. I actually used one of these as a driving iron for a while. It felt really weird off the face, and you had no idea where it was going. But more times out of not, it was going straight. So I kept on uh, using it. Oh, look at the uh, grip yeah. on that. I really like all the customized colors and stuff in here as well. Mm -hmm. Got an RBZ, got the uh, copper. That thing looks nice. Really nice. The uh, Ricky Fowler colorway right there. Look at all the uh, high end shafts up there as well. Oh, wow. And we got a bunch of the uh, newer stuff. If you guys are here for new stuff, you probably have already clicked off. Got Han. Oh, look at this Bridgestone JGR brand new in plastic. <laughs> that is pretty awesome. <laughs> you comment below if you remember the uh, yellow or when Bridgestone made putters and they had that weird foam grip. It's like the stuff you put over a microphone. I didn't what? like them at all. I loved Bridgestone stuff, but their putters were terrible. But they would like disintegrate here in like four seconds, the humidity. I don't know. 
There was some and rubbing in your bag too. There's some Area 51 materials yeah, going not, on there. I'm not, I'm not a fan of that. I don't know who that. approved that design, but <laughs> right. I don't remember why they did it either. Especially it was since dumb. obviously they're known for like tires and rubber. Yeah, you would think they would have <laughs> right. a, a easy access to rubber. <laughs> now you think about rubber. it. Well, check this out though. Got another Tiffany. These ones have the uh, tensile blue shafts oh, in there. Oh yeah, tied together and the furls too. <laughs> oh yeah, oh yeah. We saw a set of those at uh, PGA Tour Superstore too. Not too long ago. Never yeah. seen them before. Now we've seen it twice. Twice. Twice is nice. Look at all these uh, high-end shafts up here. Get the uh, 10 size. Uh, oh, here you go. The, uh, the Oban Kiyoshis. We actually found a, a Gary Woodland tour issue driver yes. that had a Oban Kiyoshi, the purple one. Get Miyazaki. Whoa, the ha I think these are the RDX. Yeah, the RDX uh, hazardous shafts. Those are ridiculously expensive. 350 bucks. Wow. Yeah. All right. Well, let's. I think oh, we have. Oh, they got drizzle sticks. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Oh, it's a grail. It's a grail. <laughs> R7 Limited. Check out the colorway on this guy right here. The tailor-made Pittsburgh Persimmon. <laughs> That's awesome. That is cool. All right, let's go see if we can get a, a tour of the uh, high-end putters and yes. maybe uh, make a dent on our uh, bank account. Oh, look at the uh, TSR2 with the Oban Kiyoshi shaft. Dang. My favorite shaft. And my favorite driver of the year. That's Mitsubishi Fubuki is my favorite shaft to say, but the say. Oban Kiyoshis are probably my favorite shaft. That is cool. Not something you see every day. All right, let's. Oh, here's the uh, pre made sets that I was uh, talking about. You even got a Yes putter. Look at it's even color weighed out. You got the Yes, you got the Rocket Blades, you got the tailor made bag, you got the Cobras that are usually that colorway as well. That's amazing. Fascinating stuff in here. I think I've used the word fascinating and interesting as many times as a human has ever done in about <laughs> 10 minutes, but let's go see if we can uh, check out the, uh, the Scotty Cameron collection. So check this out. These are some of the nicest Scotty Cameron's that I have ever seen. And we got the uh, Bobby Grace also as nice. uh, well. They took about for us to uh, check out, but check out all the custom uh, paint fills on this. These are not from like the uh, Scotty Cameron custom shop, but I have, they're these done are, in -house, I'm not going to yeah. say they're uh, better, but they're definitely equal. I think these ones might actually be better. They're more like creative in terms of the uh, colorway. We mm -hmm. got the uh, custom weight ports right here on the uh, select flow black number five. We got the uh, super select new uh, Newport two plus. This is uh, this year's model. Got custom uh, weights on there as well. And uh, the guy who does all of the uh, custom uh, painting, he has his uh, personal putter over there. It's got forty uh, gram weights on there, and I think he said like a hundred gram counterbalance on there. And it looks the pretty true uh, sweet. True heavy putter. Yeah, we got the uh, Phantom Twelve custom paint shop, and check this guy out right here. That's the so Smart cool. Fit. <laughs> the smart, I can't even say. It's so excited to see it in person. A Smart Fit F18 Bobby Grace ultra high rpm with the hole seeking material insert on there oh. and the uh, grip oh the line too that is so cool stack golf colors right there That's it's meant amazing. to be we'll have to do some negotiating a uh, husband and wife off camera on that one might come back at it do that for a uh when a we hit two hundred fifty thousand, yeah. we'll give away a scotty and i might buy that one for myself <laughs> but uh, the custom uh, colorways the on blue, there yeah. and look at all of the uh, head covers you got three scotty cameron mickey ones so many cool uh, head covers. If you guys are Scotty Cameron collectors, this is probably a Nirvana for you. You just sit here all day staring at them. And then like the mural, the background too, just the entire oh, yeah. area, so cool. The gruesome foursome is an awesome head cover as well. Uh huh. But uh, hopefully you guys did find this video awesome. If you're ever in like the theme park area, you can get a, a helicopter ride over yeah, here. Yeah. Air Force fun going on up there. <laughs> But uh, hopefully you guys uh, did like this video, America's Golf Outlet. It's pretty amazing. Hopefully you guys did like this video. You found it amazing. And, well, oh, I got actually an early Christmas present. Wait for tomorrow's video with the uh, fully decked out uh, Christmas. Uh, <laughs> but there you go. Yeah, Some Vans MTs in the uh, green colorway. Almost as cool as the uh, Taylor Made Mini Burner that uh, Ashley bought me yesterday. And the hat from last year. Oh, yeah, the Jordan hat. How I almost missed that? I don't know. But uh, hopefully you guys have been enjoying the uh, seven days or seven golf uh Shops in seven days. Easy to say. We got one more day. Yeah. <laughs> we'll see you then. We'll see you then. Bye, guys. Look at all of the Scotties. So cool. One more. Here you go. This is the thumbnail right here. Here. Just like point. Or get closer. Get closer. Oh, 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 oh. oh, maybe I can do point 0.5, then you don't have to get as close. Oh. Nailed it. We're actually going to use that one. Totally going to use that one. <laughs> it's a rare. Perfect. Bye, guys. Thanks for watching. Also, totally bought the uh, Bob Barker The Price is Wrong head covers, and we got another guy landed in here. Well, I hope you guys did like this video. If you did like, subscribe, and we'll see you next time. See you next oh, time. Wait, and this, the orange Scotty? He said it was the pumpkin spice edition. Yeah, the orange Scotty in there. It had a matching uh, orange uh, 
Super stroke grip. That's kind of amazing. Also, we did get the F8 for Ashley and the Brilliant Nickel. I think those also, were less than $100 uh, total. The Brilliant Nickels on those go for a uh, mm -hmm. lot and the uh, Bob Barker high cover is amazing. Also, it's very bright without a brim. So. Oh, yeah, yeah. Beanie, uh... <laughs> right. Beanies also, are nice. I, I've like totally forgotten how to hold the camera. I was like pointed up like that on you. Well, because for six days I've been holding it. Yeah, there you go. I, I lose uh, the right? rhythm very quickly. <laughs> Del Taco, comment below. Del Taco versus uh, Taco Bell. Uh, Actually, think... we're going to pick a random person from uh, the uh, comments. Comment Del Taco versus Taco Bell, and we're going to give away a $20 gift card to either one. Whoever wins, there get there. Go. We're going to randomly pick Choose it. Choose your fate. Choose your fate. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> and now, for real. Bye. Bye. <laughs>